As holders of the Cooperative Insurance Cup, Glenthorne were determined to make it into the final and a mistake by Portadown keeper Neil Armstrong gifted them the opening goal. Armstrong failed to control Ross Redmond's back pass. Richard Clark pounced for 1-0. Former Glentoran keeper Armstrong could only watch as Clark and his teammates celebrated. Redmond supplied Sean Mackle for the equaliser from the wing on the stroke of half time. Glen's keeper Elliot Morris with really little chance of saving his powerful header. Mackle's third goal in two games. Scott Young's side kept pressurising the Portadown defence in the second half, but to no avail. Then David Harlan's ball in found Colin Nixon. But in the end, the header was just over the bar. 1-1 after full time. Extra time was necessary, just as it had been between Lisburn Distillery and Crusaders in the other semi-final. The winning goal came courtesy of Portadown substitute Richard Leckie, and it's one he should be proud of. Look how he scythes through the Glentorn defence, never taking his eye off the target. An excellent solo effort to put Ronnie McFall's men into the cup final. Let's hear now from Lecky and losing Glentoran manager Scott Young. Uh, I've come off the bench and scored a few times this year. Um, obviously, I'd rather be starting, you know. But I mean, if, if I can bring a contribution to the team from the bench, all well and be it, you know. And what does it mean to pull it down to, to be in another final? Well, it's fantastic, you know. We're, um, we seem to be making a bit of a habit of it. Um, that's the Irish Cup last year and the, the CIS the year before. Um, so obviously, in our current position, it's good to get cup runs because we haven't been doing that well in the league, but. You know, every victory we get now, you know, we're starting to build confidence, and I think we've got a good chance now in the final. You know, to lose the semi-final was a very, very bitter pill to swallow. Um, you know, and see, we have to get on with. But um, you know, the first half we did not play well. We were gifted the goal. Uh, second half was slightly better, um, possession-wise and passing the ball, but without creating chances. Um, we never worked. The Porto Downs goalkeeper. We never showed composure and creativity in the final third, and um, you know that cost us tonight. And both of Porto Downs goals seem to come against the run of play. Yeah, um, I think the, the goals that we lost were uh, bad, bad goals, and um, you know. But the most disappointing thing for me was the guy Tom did not. We did we created very, very little to be honest with you, and uh, for the, the, the possession we had and the passing. Um, we didn't get to the byline and put crosses in. We didn't ask questions of, of, of the, the two fullbacks and the, the two centre halves as such. And um, you know, if you, if you don't do that, then you then you're going to struggle, and that's the reason why we're not in the final.